according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, lung cancer is the leading cause of cancer deaths and the second most common cancer among both men and women in the United States. The agency states that the most important thing a person can do to lower their lung cancer risk is to quit smoking and to avoid secondhand smoke. The second leading cause of lung cancer is radon, a naturally occurring gas that comes from rocks and dirt and can be trapped in houses and buildings. People can also be exposed to substances and chemical compounds at work that could increase their chances of developing lung cancer. There are many known workplace carcinogens that may be present in dusts or fumes, including, but by no means limited to, asbestos, arsenic, diesel exhaust, and some forms of silica and chromium. For some of these substances, the CDC reports the risk of getting lung cancer is even higher for those who smoke. A number of these hazardous substances may also be present in people's homes and communities. For example, asbestos and radon can be found in homes from coast to coast. Other factors may include a family history of lung cancer, radiation therapy to the chest, and even potentially a person's diet. Lung cancer begins in the lungs and may spread to lymph nodes or other organs in the body. Cancer from other organs also may spread to the lungs. Lung cancers are usually grouped into two main types called small cell and non-small cell. These types of lung cancer grow differently and are treated differently. Non-small cell lung cancer is more common than small cell lung cancer. For some people who develop lung cancer, they may just have general symptoms of not feeling well and unfortunately most people with lung cancer don't have symptoms until the cancer is advanced. These are just a few things to know about lung cancer and airborne contaminants. To learn more about this or other indoor air quality, environmental, health, and safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.